this is a work object how many attachments are there in this work object let's have a look at it okay how many attachments are there four, four attachments you can see here also okay not only in our screen here it is commonly available Pega class November 26, December 3, response, uh, Pega class running notes. Like this, you have how many attachments? Four attachments. So, what is the page line scheme of this work object? So, here you go. This work object's page line scheme is So into given capital letter, okay. All in the page name is key, class name will be capital letters. Okay. Now I will take this and go to attachments table. Go to attachments table. Select query you have written now. Just modify the query. So from fetch from where where px f object key is equal to value. This is the value. So PX, PX ref object key is equal to this value means from data work attached file. How many records you have got? Four records. Okay. From link attachment, we will see. Okay. So link attachment. Where is link attachment? PC underscore link attachment. Link attachment. Where is it? Link attachment. Scripts select query. So here what we need to do is. In the link attachment where px linked reference from is equal to px linked reference from is equal to this value just i am directly showing on so here also four records are there so just to tell you some requirement just i am going to show you directly okay just look at here now i am going to create one work object okay so the work object ID today state first work object it is going to be with no attachments attached. Okay. There are no attachments. As of now, you can see zero attachments. I'll close this work object. I'll close this six zero. I mean, like last time work object. Now, what am I going to do is oh, I'm sorry. I have to know the work object ID value, right? Today's date. I mean, like I'll just uh, copy this one. Okay. Yeah, this this has uh, yeah today's date this one. Okay, you can see here. Okay, so this work object doesn't have any attachments, and this work object has four attachments. Now you can go to directly back and I am directly showing you. Okay, look at here now. PX linked reference from. So what are these attachments? Just give me one minute. Aadhaar card, pollution. Okay, pollution check and pan card. Two things, pollution check and pan card. What am I going to do? Just look at here. PX linked reference from. This value I am directly modifying. I'm going to directly modify this particular value. So what am I going to do is PX linked reference from in the link attachment table, the ID value I am changing. Save OK. And this one, here you go. Save OK. And then you are going to save the changes to the database per committed. Now go to data work attached file table. Okay. In the data work attached file table, what is that pollution check and other card I did not modify. Yeah. Okay, I'll do one thing. Mm. Just give me a moment, I'll tell you. Uh, what is that you told? Pan card. Okay. Okay, December 3 rest response. Okay, here you go. December 3 and rest response, right? Okay, these two attachments, right? 
so here px ref object key value i'm modifying px ref object key value I'm modifying so directly going to the table i'm just doing this so this is like an update you are doing an update these updates can be done by using activity also you can do obj open by handle and do update now after you do this just go to the work objects as of now this work object has zero right just refresh this work object just to refresh it so once you refresh what is happening you just make an observation so what is happening now so far this doesn't have any attachments but now how it has two attachments it has it used to have four attachments right just let me refresh this one as well what actually we have done is we have moved attachments from one object to another object this may be a requirement in real time okay for this if you want to implement this i went to directly table and did it okay you need to take the parameters what parameters to pass first work object page line is key second work object page line is key from where from which work object to which work object you, move, you want to move the attachments both work objects related attachment uh, both work object related page line is key if you know then you can start writing an activity to retrieve the data and modify the update the data of px linked reference from and px ref object key columns accordingly where you are actually what you are doing is you are moving attachments from one work object to another work object in real time you will not have access to database like this to directly modify and that anyhow that is not going to be a process so you can try by yourself because you know about one requirement we have done updating the status bulk update the same requirement same number of same type of steps you need to follow here also in order to implement this one so you can transfer the attachments from one work object to another work object to do this what is the knowledge that you should have about the pegaros process commander databases you should clearly know about relation between work table and attachment tables you should know if you do not know this you cannot implement this requirement so you should have a clear idea about work table page line is key value is equal to attachment table px ref object key at the same time work table page line is key value is equal to link attachment table px linked reference from everyone clear online students are you clear every one of you everyone yes. okay so here you go now yes, today's trade only i'm right okay so you can try to do that requirement by yourself once if you try you will come to know okay